So how does C-Sharp compiler work? Is C-Sharp a compiled language or an interpreted one? Good questions. Let's answer them one by one. First, we write some C-Sharp code. If it has a main method or top-level statements, it will become an executable, otherwise a library, which can be used by other executables. The first step is C-Sharp compiler, which checks if code contains errors or not. If errors are found, it will tell developers information about those errors. Otherwise, it will convert the C-Sharp code to intermediate code. The IL code generated can run on any operating system because C-Sharp is platform independent. We can use IL disassembler to see the IL code generated. Although IL is similar to Java bytecode, bytecode is interpreted, not compiled. After IL is generated, next part is JIT, which means just in time, which is part of the CLR, meaning common language runtime. When you run the generated application, Bootstrapper initializes the CLR and instructs to execute our assembly. Then the CLR finds main entry. Because it's the first execution, all addresses of method functions have the address of JIT compiler. Then JIT compiles the IL code into actual assembly code for the appropriate architecture. Once the code is compiled, the JIT goes into the method vector table and replaces the address with the one of the compiled code so that every subsequent call no longer invokes the JIT. So this is how this sharp compiler works. In a sentence, this sharp is compiled into IL and before first execution, it's converted to assembly code by JIT compiler. I hope you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe and see you in another video.